I'm Jim, and I am playing Fear, and I am having a pants scared off me, and about to turn a wheel. It's gonna be exciting. Oh my god, wheels! I have no idea what that just did for me. That's, that's not a weapon, that's a hammer. I haven't I haven't hallucinated for a while. Maybe this means my character is getting better. I'm recovering from whatever horrible mental trauma this game has inflicted on me, and I am ready to be a whole person. Again. Or you know, I'm totally lost and not advancing the plot in any way. What is the the ten millimeter HV penetrator? Okay, we're gonna pick that up instead of this submachine gun, because that sounds pretty awesome. Um, I'm betting it's some kind of armor-piercing gun. I'm not gonna try it out, because I don't think I have very much ammo for it. Who am I kidding? I'm totally gonna try it out. Oh, yeah. Now I want some jerk to come and mess with me. I'm just gonna be like, yeah. Oh, Jesus. I can't swim. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I know, I'm full on pretty much everything. Oh, so even if I would have made it up there, I couldn't have opened that, or across that fire, I could not have opened that door. That is awesome. Thanks, game. Alright, here we go. We're gonna penetrate something here. Do you hear that creepy noise, too? It's been a while since I... Oh, yeah, there's my hallucination. Where is Alma? I don't know what you're talking about. Some secrets get buried deeper than others. But I know where to dig. Is it the no, couch? wait, you, you've got the wrong guy. I dig in the couch. Hush and now, I have, Mr. Moody. I mean, the all time kinds for talk is done. Of, of change. Please, no! Whatever else. I mean, just, just dig in the couch, really. Or not. Unless, unless you're in Minecraft, in which case, dig around like 12 for diamonds and like 40 for everything else. Um, and by Minecraft, I, of course, mean League of the Beast, because League of the Beast is my, is my jam. Oh, is it? Yeah, this is a high-tech gun. It's cool. I can just whack stuff with it. This probably isn't super expensive or anything. Like how it... Whoop. Okay, listen up, game. Creepy people crawling around the tunnels? Not cool. Not cool. Are we clear? Okay. We're gonna keep going now. We're gonna switch to the shotgun. Okay, that is not one of the breakable things. Okay, hey, those footsteps are my footsteps. Oh, I found a locker room. I can finally get out of this level. Apparently. Awesome. And I'm excited. Steve, what news do you have for me? Oh, I keep thinking that control is uh, crouch. It's not. It's time shift. I would remap them, but I actually really like having control on... Uh, Time shift, slow motion, reflexy thing. Oh no, we can use the penetrator. This seems like a kind of long range gun. I don't know anything about it, but it has a very fine crosshair, which tells me that. I wonder if there's falling damage in this game. I'm gonna go with yes. <laughs> Jesus! He deserved to die. Well, okay, whatever that hallucination was, I totally to flat out missed it. I feel okay about that. I'm just gonna pretend that never happened. Do 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 do. I'm I'm fine. Steve will radio and be like, "Are you seeing things? No, no, everything's fine here. How are you?" All right. I keep listening for stormtroopers. 
a devastating explosion in the harbor this evening oh, may not have been an accident. Radio. We have learned that evidence of a fierce gun battle has been found by police investigators. It's making a noise, so I feel like it's important, but I don't know why it would be important. This doesn't seem like that kind of game. Creepy little girl. See, happily... Is this the room where that guy was interrogating the other guy? That was totally... I'm good. I've got the penetrator, which I have yet to even fire. But yeah, see, I'm still sort of in Fallout 3 mode, which means I'm inclined to ignore hallucinations and sort of, that guy is not real. He was walking wrong. I'm inclined to ignore hallucinations and search for ammunition, even though I have lots of ammo. But now we're... There's another blood spatter. There's something in the water. Okay. Thank you, Dave Matthews. For those of you who were alive during the 1990s. Oh, God. Could you please turn down all the scary? Now we're gonna have a raid. Oh wait, I can control my own rave. Oh, it's not. Okay. What? Flashlight. Oh, little fire girl. Come on, make a push. Okay. But if necessary, I will open fire on you with my shotgun, little girl. I just need you to know that. This is like a, a level for Max Payne, only you can't fall off the edge. What the fuck? I have no idea what's going on now. The ceiling is made of blood, and I can see myself reflected in it. Um, everything behind me is dark, and the darkness is encroaching. And everything's fine. Ish. Okay. We're just gonna keep going. We're just gonna pretend like that never happened. That's just a this is the light fixture. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. My UI is flickering. Oh, because I have to. Actually, there's an assault rifle in this room and a bunch of cover and some body armor. There's probably going to be, at some point, guys who will turn these lights on, run in this room, and shoot at me. Just mentally preparing for that. So, those guys I can deal with. Alright, time to wake up. Um, oh, wait, you're alive! Finds her. Oh my god! Origin. Sorry? Talking about. Oh, what Can you have a first aid pack? 
All right, buddy, get moving. Battle's gotta be close. But I have first aid. Like, I know first aid. I'm a combat trooper. I can... I had a feeling. really not good at fighting shotguns. Okay. You guys brought some machine guns. That's nice, but that's not the ammo that I need. So I appreciate it. Thank you. I hope you weren't alive. Because, you know, sorry if you were. gets different when you get that shotgun. More body armor. That means that there are probably guys that are going to come and shoot at me. Oh. Ooh, what was that? Are you shooting the thing that I have at me? Because if you are, that's cool. I can use another one. If not, then I'm curious as to what you're shooting at me. That was definitely the penetrator thingy, so it's... Ooh, Jesus. Yeah, okay, so, so maybe its thing is that it's silent? I mean, that doesn't seem like it makes a big deal. It doesn't... Like, one shot to the head doesn't kill these guys. So... Shotgun, which I mean, is a shotgun, and pretty much just sort of disqualifies anyone from the fight. 
this music? Oh no, someone didn't leave an assault rifle here. I shot the guy who was on this balcony. Or grenaded him or something. I'll be honest, kind of losing track. I'm the six um, med packs though, so maybe I better, you know, smarten up a bit. Shotgun is not the best weapon for everything. I know, I, I know this sounds like heresy, but, but hear me out here. Oh wow, that was that was pretty quick. Pax the Fettle and Replica forces are continuing organized withdrawal from South River Wastewater Treatment Plant after locating another of Fettle's victims. Fear operative neutralized Replica Rear Guard. That's me. No wait, the Fear operative is me. The Replica Rear Guard units are not me, and is continuing to pursue retreating enemy forces. And shoot them. Tomcat, this is Dead Mother. I know you guys are hurting, but we could really use your help with this armor camp situation. So are you talking to me? I just me? lost contact with my recon team, and the brass wants me to or send in more men. The enemy, no, 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 you don't have a creepy story to do this. You're with probably, you're probably. My orders are to secure this guy, Fettle. Getting rid of him will break his telepathic link to the soldiers. Once they no longer have an objective, they should shut down. That sure would be nice. I'm Tell shutting you what, him down. Can you spare a chopper? We're seeing what looks like a full-scale withdrawal. My gut tells me Fettle's on his way to armor camp, so maybe we can help each other out. Can do. So maybe I haven't been paying as close attention to the text at the beginning of the level than I should have. That is a thing I was supposed to see. Can't shoot that guy. But that's a mine. Moral of the story? Watch out for mines. Game gets more and more like Fallout 3 with every passing second. Seriously, I can't find anything remotely appealing in that game without finding out that someone has put a landmine on it somewhere. But those people are jerks. I just find. Why, guys, you keep leaving your guns behind. It's just careless, really. That, I don't think, worked out the way I wanted it to, but at least it didn't blow me up, I guess. Oh no, that was the ladder that I just sort of went up. Oh. Okay, I have a $50,000 assault rifle. I don't actually know which one's sort of. I just lost Gankowski's signal. Maybe the gear got damaged. Maybe. Here. Once they've got the fire under control, we can check the rubble. Let them handle it. I need you on standby oh, to head inside armor camp as soon as the site is secure. Roger. You guys want to maybe, like, ask me how I'm doing? Or, you know, include me in this in any way? It's cool. Just just talk about me like I'm not here. That's not rude at all. Um, can I go through you? You're a door? Nope. Okay. It's cool. I don't think that was a hallucination. I think that was a guy who just turned invisible. I realize how fine the line is on that. But, I mean, I wouldn't put it past them to have, like, cloaking devices or something. Okay. Oh, well, actually, it does. Uh, oh my god, I stuck him to the wall. Okay, this, this is my new favorite gun. favorite gun. I stuck that guy to a wall. 
probably unnecessary in in the case of this guy here. I probably I probably could have just shotgunned him. I mean, let's go over there and get some ammo. These wheels look important, but I can't turn them, so I don't care. Yeah, these guys have assault rifles. I'm liking the, 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 whole, the whole sort of three guns thing. I mean, this came out, I feel like this came, this came out in 2005, and I feel like it came out at the same time, around the same time as Doom 3, which was still in that you can carry a billion guns phase, but limiting the amount of guns you can carry, I think, is a good decision. Also, this level, I gotta say, despite the fact that it's ridiculous, is highly intuitive. I am not getting lost, and believe me, one could get lost in a level. It's easier. Okay, so one over here, and there's probably going to be some guys over there to shoot at me because that's the kind of room this is. Nope, there we are. First aid kit. And a penetrator. Okay, so they really want me using this penetrator. I don't know what I just got. Oh, health permanently increased. Nice. Okay, but that door doesn't work. So is there maybe a console or something in here that I have to use? No, these all look pretty generic. I can't. That is apparently how I use a computer. All right, fair enough. That's pretty much how I use one now. Uh, let's start looking for access hashes. I, just as I was saying that this level design is highly intuitive, that is definitely the ground where I came out, right? No, it can't be. It can't be. There's gotta be... Alright, well, we're gonna go down and check it out. And, uh, we'll, we'll figure it out, I don't know, next week or something. I'll see you guys later.